Hello students. In this video, we'll discuss two very important status bar commands: object snap and object snap tracking. Both are interrelated to each other, right? So let us discuss object snap first. Object snap is the status bar command without which you cannot draw even a single figure in the AutoCAD, right? So F3 is the shortcut key for object snap with the with the help of F3 you can activate or deactivate object snap right so this is the option for object snap on the status bar so if I click on this it will be activated if I click again on this it will deactivate or you can do it by F3 also pressing F3 right so I am for the time being I am just deactivating it let us go to line command now I am drawing a line of let us say 70 mm right so this line is of 70 mm so let us dimension this line I am going to linear dimensioning let us click over here let us again click over here so you just see the length of line it is 69.76 right but what dimension that I had entered it was 70 so I'll just again delete it and let us try to dimension it again so first corner and the second corner so now again it is 70.07 okay 70.07 .07, I wanted it to come out to be 70.00 right so if I just zoom in so you can see I had to click on this corner but I managed to click you know somewhat far from this from this corner so it is over here let us see the other way other side so here also on this I wanted to click over here okay but I managed to click you know somewhat at somewhat distance from this corner right so now what is this problem the problem is I am not getting a precise point where to click right so I will activate object snap click on object snap go to object snap settings right click on object snap go to object snap settings so here many options are there ok so you just click on select all and then press ok go to linear dimensioning click on linear dimensioning click over here so this green colored indication if you can see it has come because of object snap right so it is indicating that this is the end point you can click over here so I, I'll click over here then let us move to the next corner so here also I'm getting this indication that this is the end point you can click over here so when I click so automatically you see it is 70 mm right so the dimension that had entered the length of line was 70 mm okay so when I have dimensioned it it has also come out to be 70 mm also if you want to draw a line from this existing line so it will again you know uh, tell you where is the end point so you click over here you can extend this line okay you want to click on the midpoint of the line so this is the midpoint of the line so here also you can click right so if I right click on object snap you can see number of options are there end point midpoint extension center tangent parallel so all these points it will be indicating right so I suppose object snap is clear to you next is object snap tracking so object snap tracking is also very important and it actually makes it convenient to draw any figure right 
so let us suppose I have this line and then I have this line okay I'm turning on the object snap tracking so F11 is the shortcut key for object snap tracking right f11 so this is on so let me turn on the line command so just see i am i'll just move on this end point i am not clicking anywhere so you do not click anywhere so you move your cursor towards the top so i suppose you are able to see this dotted line which is tracking this end point and then again let me move to this corner so we are tracking both of these so you can see that this is the intersection of these two lines when extended okay towards the top so I can click over here so if I require to you know uh, draw or draw any figure from this corner I can do that right similarly let us move to the other figure also let me just complete it so there we go now this can track the perpendicular points also let us suppose i want to track it from here and i want to track it from here so you can track both these corners like this so you can just click on the intersection of these dotted lines right so this is how object snap tracking work so i think it is clear to you thank you very much